Guys, is there a spider behind me? I, I don't know what to do. There's a witch cooking something next to me in a little pot. I think there's a spider behind me. I can't move my body because I'm just a pumpkin head, but I really need to know what's going on. And welcome back to another episode of Roblox. Today, we are going to be checking out the new Halloween Meep City update. I don't really remember how Meep City looked last year during the Halloween time, but I've done a little bit of browsing around here. I didn't do too much because I didn't want to spoil it for myself, but I did do a little bit of searching and it looks so cool. Like, look at this little toxic ooze. Wait, if I go in the toxic ooze, am I going to turn into an alien? Or maybe I kind of am already an alien. I have no idea. But look, guys, I also have my fedora on that I got from the Halloween event the other day, and it's a little nerf fedora i'm not gonna keep it on forever because my hair kind of warps through it for some reason in roblox i just cannot wear hats but i'm so excited about this update it's gonna be so cool look at those spider web in the beginning guys i'm the spider i'm the slithery little spider and these people are all trapped inside my web and i'm gonna eat everybody just kidding i'm not gonna eat you guys i wouldn't eat you guys all right, so the first thing I think we should probably do in this new Halloween Meep City update is we should probably get a costume on. And the only way that I know how to get a costume on is to go and edit my avatar. So we're going to go edit our avatar and we're going to get something cool. We got to come up with something super duper sleek, super duper fresh. I know there's these outfits right here, so we could already just become a doge. Yeah, I'm a doge for Halloween. Or we could become a police officer. But I think we should customize a really, really good outfit. So let's see. Let's go to... <gasps> should we be something spooky or should we be something super cute? Where are the faces? Where are the faces? Aren't there faces somewhere? Maybe they don't actually have specific faces you can wear. I thought that they did. Maybe it's under the accessories. Here they are. I thought there was. Oh my goodness. Okay. Oh, that one's super scary right there. Oh my goodness, look at this one. We could be a vampire. We're like an evil police officer. Mm, we're scary. We could be an evil ninja. An evil vampire ninja police officer. <laughs> we just mix so many different things. That's what we're going to be. Wait a minute. I have such a good idea. Where are the pants? Let's go to our pants. And can we put on the doge pants? <gasps> oh my goodness, guys. We're an, e or an evil ninja vampire doge police officer. Wait, wait for it. Wait for it. Dragon. <laughs> yes, we are a ninja, vampire, police officer, doge, dragon. <laughs> That's what we're going to be for Halloween this year. This is perfect. All right, let's go on our adventure. I really just want to go around and see all the stuff that they updated and what they changed. We can go into the store, too, and see if they updated any furniture items. I didn't read anything on them updating any furniture items, but we might as well check it out. We might as well. Hello, Ding Dong. Had you, did you add anything Halloween-y? Can I add... No, I don't need candy. Candy's not Halloween. Uh, no new Halloween posters. Any new entertainment Halloween thingies? No. Any new... <gasps> yes, they do! Oh, my goodness. Oh, and I have tons of coins as well, which is super exciting. Okay, pumpkin bean bag. So let's go ahead and get one of those. And then a just a, a bucket of pumpkins, I guess, works there as well. We're just going to get all the, new, all the new Halloween things. No Halloween thing will go unpurchased. Coffin couch? <gasps> oh, my goodness. This is so cool. I could set up an entire Halloween room. Let's do this. Confirm your spooky ghost. <gasps> Got the spooky ghost. And then I, I don't know if the potted plant is part of the Halloween thing, but it says that it's new. So I'm going to go ahead and buy that one as well. Perfect. Okay, so we can go to our house later. Actually, super soon. And we can go and put down our new Halloween items. Yay. So there was some new furniture, which is really cool. I actually had no idea if there was furniture or not. So we got the spider web in the middle, the toxic ooze that you can go fishing in because it's super spooky. Oh, wait, I didn't even know that there were two. Have there always been two fishing ponds in the in the main part of Meep City? I have no idea. I do want to head over to the plaza, though, and see if there's anything new Halloween-y in the plaza. So far, everything's normal. But that's what they want you to think. Hello, is there spooky pizza in here? I've, I've even got my, my costume, my Halloween costume on, which means that you could give me free pizza. Hello, can I have free pizza? And take this. Thank you. Oh, it's going through my head. That's okay. It's Halloween. Anything is possible during Halloween. Sit this down at the table and let's just eat all my pizza. Eat all the pizza. Yeah, delicious pizza. Okay, so it doesn't actually look like... Oh my goodness, my face is so scary. But it doesn't actually look like there's any Halloween updates in the plaza, which is okay. Ooh, honestly, the hospital would be a perfect place to have little Halloween stuff because it's like the haunted spooky hospital. Spoopy, spooky hospital. Hello, is there spooky things in here? Is anything really spooky in here or is everything pretty normal in here? Can we adopt any spooky pumpkin babies? No, the babies are still cuter than ever. Look, they're so cute. Oh, except it kind of warps through my body, so I'm going to get rid of that. So it looks like they didn't update anything inside of the plaza. 
They updated a lot in the playground, but they, I should have done something out here. Let's go to, isn't there another thing too? There's the houses, there's the plaza, and I think that there's one more thing somewhere. Yeah, the town right here. So let's see if they updated anything inside the town. What is happening? Wait a minute. Yeah, they updated a lot inside the town. I can't even go there. What is going on? I'm like constantly falling forever and ever and ever. What is happening? Guys, the town is totally different. Halloween has made a bigger effect than we thought. I look so happy though as I'm falling. I'm like, hee 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 hee. I'm falling into the space and world and I'm gonna die. Go ahead and reset the character. All right, let's try that again. Maybe we won't actually go into the void this time and go completely far into the space. Maybe we'll actually be able to enter. <gasps> nope, yep, the town is just broken. Yep, town is, town is totally broken, guys. <laughs> we were not even able to go into the town. So I guess the next thing to do, if that's all that's really changed out here, is go into the neighborhood, which is over here. And then we can go to put down our furniture decorations. Hopefully we're even able to go into the neighborhood, honestly. Am I allowed to be here? Oh, look at the spooky ghost. Oh my goodness, guys, we can go trick or treating in our new costume. Okay, this one looks really cool. I got little pumpkins on the roof and this little scary pumpkin right here. Here lies, oh, it tells you the person's estate by saying like here lies on a little uh, tombstone. That is so cool. And this little Casper right there, he's like, hey guys, hey, what's going on? <laughs> Hope you guys are having a good day trick treating out there. <laughs> this is so great. Where's my house? My house is over here. Wow, guys, look. Wait, why does it say I'm not applicable? Why is it, why, why can't I be on the sign? All I wanna do is be on the sign. I can't be on the tombstone. I didn't die, I guess. I'm still alive. I'm still very alive. Oh, look, we have a cute little spider on the side of our house. Can we climb it? Wait, if I climb from the pumpkin to the spider, <gasps> wait, to the window, is this gonna work? No, I don't think it's gonna work. But it's so cool. We have a little spider friend who's gonna eat all the other bugs that we don't want in our house. So totally okay with it. Oh, and look at this guy. Aw, he looks so scared. He's like, uh, is there a spider behind me? Guys, is there a spider behind me? I, I don't know what to do. There's a witch cooking something next to me in a little pot. I think there's a spider behind me. I can't move my body because I'm just a pumpkin head, but I really need to know what's going on. That is so funny. Ooh, and there's a witch pumpkin over here, and then there's a little angry pumpkin jack-o'-lantern over there. And uh, is this a ghost up there? Is that a ghost? Whoa, it's a weird green ghost who's like falling from the window. He's like, no, falling from the window. That is so cool. Oh, it doesn't even have my picture right there. I think my picture is just totally broken for whatever reason. Honestly, I haven't been inside my Meep City house in such a long time. I really need to finish decorating it. I say that every single time, but I've only fully decorated a couple rooms. Like, I'm oh, fishy. <gasps> We're vampires together. I had no idea that Fishy was gonna be a vampire too. Look guys, wait, wait, I wanna get a selfie. I wanna get a selfie with, with Fishy. Look, we're both vampires, that is so cute. But I finished this bathroom right here and then I finished this bathroom over here and then I really just need to do a lot more work. Maybe we'll put all the Halloween stuff out here. I have no idea. And then this room I finished. I actually really like this room. I think I did a really good job with this room in here. And then this room in here is the kitchen, which could use a little bit more work, I guess, because I didn't totally finish everything. And my bedroom in here. Maybe this room here will be our Halloween room. I think that's gonna be a good idea. So let's go, what? No, I don't wanna teleport to my estate. I'm already in my estate. Let me build, how do I, oh wait, it's this button right here, isn't it? Yeah, here we go. So let's put the coffin couch is gonna go in the corner, or I guess in the middle of the room. Let's set it up this way, so it's like that. And then the tombstone, wait, is this the tombstone? Yeah, wait, wait, is it sideways? I'm really confused. I'm gonna put it over in this corner of the room right there. Does that work? Wait, I can't see, is it even three dimensional or does it lay flat? Oh, wait a minute, it's like a poster. Oh, it's supposed to go on the wall. That's okay, okay, so let's put that right there. I think that looks good, right? Is it a, yeah, it's like a little wall thingy, wall tombstone. Actually, let's move this back to right there, and then we can put the pumpkin bean bag. We can kind of catty corner it to right there. We need to go get something to put the, like a TV or something on, or get a TV. We should also go back and get another rug for this room. Is there any Halloween themed rugs? I have no idea. Let's put the spooky ghost down though. Uh, we could put that down. We'll be like, we'll be like the person who is in the, the tombstone is like coming out of it. And we'll put the pond plant. We could put that in this corner right here. There we go. Okay, that looks really good. Now let's exit out of this. Oh no, there's there's more pumpkins we could put down. But look, it's like, wait, I wanna move that a little bit. But it'd be as if the, the ghost is actually coming out of the tombstone. So 
Let's go ahead and just move this over to that side. I think that's going to look a lot better. Then we can put down our little pumpkin patch. Uh, I kind of want to replace this. Let's put that back in the attic. And then this will be the pumpkins over there. Perfect. So now we need to go back to the store. And we got to get a rug to put in here. And then maybe a new TV. So let's go back to the store. I'll be right back. Are rugs in furniture or are rugs in home improvement? I think they might be in furniture. I don't know. We have to go to furniture anyway, so we might as well go here first. Hello, where are the rugs? I need rugs. Where are living room? Are they in here? Yeah, rug. Okay, this one's orange at least. So yeah, we want it to be orange so we can get this one. So it'll be a perfect rug for that room. And then is there like a TV stand or something? Is there anywhere we could put the TV on? Wait, can we get this to be orange? Oh no, we can't. How about this one? Can this one be orange? This one can be orange. Let's get this one too, just in case that one looks a lot better. And then where are the stands and TVs and stuff? Entertainment, and then widescreen TV, plasma flat screen TV. I can make it, oh, we can make it like red. And it's not really orange, it's more red, but that's totally okay. Oh my goodness, there's a ball pit too? This is so cool. We should get a fog machine to make it really spooky inside of our spooky room. And then where is the, is there any sort of stand or something that we can put in there? Bedroom, I want like a shelf or something. Oh my goodness, this would be almost perfect, but we can't make it orange, which doesn't really fit the, <gasps> there's Halloween bed, bat plushie. Oh my goodness, I'm so glad I looked in here. We gotta get the Halloween bed. That is super important. I'm spending all my money today, but it is okay. I can't believe I didn't even look at the other categories to see if there's anything different. Bowl of fruit. I don't even think that's really Halloween-y, but we might as well grab it because it's new. And then living room is the stuff we already looked. Candy pack, other. I don't think there's anything Halloween. We already got the stuff in there. Uh, we can pick up the gaming chair. Uh, yeah, let's pick up the gaming chair. Let's make it blue. I like blue chairs. That'll be good for the office. Nothing in the bathroom. How about the bedroom? We already looked. A thousand times party essentials. Okay, so there's nothing really as far as a TV stand that we can get. At least it doesn't look that way. Which is totally okay, because now we have the fog machine and other things that we could use for it. Alrighty, oh yay! So let's go ahead and let's place down some of this stuff. So we want the plasma screen TV. I wish we could put something spooky on it. Hopefully we can. We're gonna see if we can put something super spooky on the TV. That's gonna go right there. And then... Wait, is that centered with the couch? I should move the couch over a little bit, and then the beanbag chair over a little bit. Oh no, I can't move the beanbag chair. Okay, that's okay. As long as the beanbag chair and everything kind of works together, I think that that will be totally okay. And then we're gonna put the zigzag rug. <gasps> this is gonna be perfect. Wait, what was the other rug that I got? Was it gonna be any better? Ooh, yeah, I think I like this one a lot better, actually. This rug, I think, looks totally, totally better. Okay, wait, let's move it up a little bit. It kind of goes right there. Yes, that looks so good. And then the fog machine. So wait, which way is the front of the fog machine? I think it's that. So let's put this in the corner over there. And we have a fog machine now. That is so cool. I want to put this a little over to center it a little bit more with the couch. <gasps> yes, that looks so good. And then we can come over here and we can replace our Oreo bed with the Halloween bed. Okay, wait, let's move it that way. And then let's put you right there. And then is there anything else? A uh, bat plushie. We got to put the bat plushie in this room over here. And then I think we're totally done. Yay, I'm so happy with this. I think it looks so good. You come into this room and it's like, ooh, spooky. Wait, we gotta turn it something more spooky on in the, uh, yeah, that's kind of spooky. Okay, yeah, I think that's the scariest thing we can turn on. All right, so that is now our new Halloween room with all the new decorations. Thank you guys so much for watching this episode of Meep City. I hope you guys did enjoy it. If you did, please leave a like right down below. Subscribe if you're not subscribed yet. If you have made it to the end of the video, comment spoopy fishy down in the comment section below. Oh, sorry, fishy. I didn't mean to push you through the wall. I apologize. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you guys next time for another episode of Roblox. Bye, guys.